Greetings, a bit of a, a random video. Um, yeah, I've gone and uh, put the battery wrong way around into this, and guess what? Protection circuitry, reverse polarity protection. Um, every protection circuitry will protect the protect protected circuitry uh, by means of self-destruction in the first place. So there you go. That's uh, that's gone and busted. Uh, release the smoke. And I've got to get a new one, because uh, this is what I was primarily using to charge my batteries. Um, anyways, what the uh, reason for this quick video is, um, someone's left a comment asking me about this mat, this background mat, and to see whether it will protect against soldering iron accidents. And, uh, yeah, well, why not? I thought, let's, uh, let's test it. I have been soldering on here uh, quite a bit, and there is uh, a number of occasions I've had uh, a little piece of solder just drop down. Let me just uh, turn it up a little bit. Um, when I was uh, trying to put some solder onto the uh, onto the iron, and yeah, this sort of thing happened. So a couple of times I. I've gone down onto it and just picked it up like that and not not much is happening to it um, So it's holding up well and yeah, there's just a bit of a uh, Just a bit of flux left. So I thought let's uh, let's actually test what uh, what happens uh, with different uh, uh, With different temperatures with this uh, Let me move the camera to the corner in case I really burn a hole in it, in it. Because I don't really want to see a big burn mark uh, right in the middle when I'm shooting the video. So um, yeah, this is uh, this is set to 250 degrees, and an occasional touch and you know dropping the iron onto this doesn't do much, to be honest. Uh, I can touch and it, it doesn't immediately burst in flames. And um, small uh, small little accidents like you know you you drop a little bit of solder and you and you pick it up from here, not a biggie. Uh, it handles it just uh, just fine, uh, not an issue with it at all. Now, if I at 250 degrees, if I press and um, hold it a little bit longer, it will start discoloring, and you can see a little bit uh, off here, and that doesn't want to come off. So I suspect uh, 250 it will start uh, at 250 degrees, uh, it will start. Uh, decomposing uh, with temperature anything higher than that it, it will the effect will be just greater but um, for general work if uh, you know a if uh, if you get a big blob of solder and it splatters on uh, onto this not a biggie uh, that will just come off and it, it doesn't leave a mark or yeah it's it's fine and you can pick up a piece of solder from here and again, not a biggie. So minor things, yes, uh, it does protect against uh, soldering iron accidents. Um, but uh, yeah, don't uh, don't try burning holes in it because if you try, you will. Um, that's all for this short video. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, subscribe for more random stuff. And that's it for this one. Take care.